Hey, welcome back to my channel. My name is Michaela. In today's video, I'm finally going to be sharing my number one asked question that I get all the time, which is how do I study for the PCAT and how do I prepare for an exam? If that's something that you've been wanting to know more about or you're about to start studying to take it during the summer months, then definitely keep on watching because I'll finally be answering that question in today's video. All right, so let's jump right on into it. So. Just a little background about me is that I am a fourth year pharmacy student and so I will be graduating this May from school. Um, I haven't taken the PCAT of course in a few years, but unfortunately for you, it has not changed within those four years. It still sucks, but unfortunately it is something that you have to take, you have to do well on to get into pharmacy school. Um, pharmacy school is very competitive and having a high GPA and a high PCAT score is just going to make your application look so much better and give you that boost that might take you and allow you to get into pharmacy school, especially your dream program if you have a school that you've been interested in. So what is Crack the PCAT? Crack the PCAT is basically a platform that allows you to not only practice with practice questions and practice exams, but it also goes through the material that you're going to be asked on the PCAT. So if you're terrible at organic chemistry or math or biology or whatever subject that you're not that comfortable with or you need a refresher because I know when you take the PCAT, those classes that you used to take were from your freshman year and so it's been a while. This course allows you either through video or through um, reading depending on your preference. It allows you to go through those courses and those topics and just kind of refresh up, get the basis of what you need, go very in depth to make sure you're well encompassed and kind of what you need to know. And then when you're ready, or if you are like me, you like to take the practice exams first and then go read what you don't know. Um, they have 10 full practice questions, or excuse me, 10 full practice exams with 2,400 practice questions. So that gives you a wealth of opportunity to realize what you're not good at, what do you need to practice more on? What are you not comfortable at? Um, it kind of highlights that and gives you that time and gives you that kind of idea of what you're, where you're standing at and whenever you take the practice exam. Um, for me, practice makes perfect. When you go into the PCAT, unfortunately, you just don't know how the exam is going to be like. And so the practice exams not only give you the opportunity to learn what you don't know, but also gives you an idea of how it's going to feel at the real exam. Like, you're not going to know. It's a standardized test, but these questions and these, the way they have their questions set up, it does give you basically the real feel of what it's going to be like in the PCAT and during that little testing room that they put you in. So definitely practice and utilize that. Um, oh, another thing that I like about taking practice exams, it also gives you a score. So it will basically estimate how you're going to do on the real PCAT, which is great because, of course, it gives you kind of an idea of where you're standing. If you have a particular school that requires a certain score, then that's really, really important. If your school only lets in students that have a, GPA, a, a PCAT of 60 or 70, you kind of need to know to make sure that you get a score that's in that level or even better. So it gives you that, which is super, super helpful if that's what you're going for and that's what you need to know. Another thing is that if you're like me and you're always on the go, well guess what? This program has an app and it also has a website. So if you want to study on your commute to the city or you want to study um, while you're waiting at the doctor's office, you can. You can sit you can sit on the app and do the question do the questions or even watch the video or read the material. You can study anywhere on the go, which is perfect for somebody like me or for any college student too um, that needs that ability. So payment. So they do have different payments and I'm just gonna be very blunt. It is a lot cheaper than some of the other courses that are out there. Some of the other courses are looking at $1,500, $1,200 for a practice, you know, PCAT type of study guy like this is. And this one's only $299. They do have other options based on um, how long you want the program for, but it's still, it's not even a frac. I mean, it's a fraction of the price compared to some of the other companies um, that are out there and other programs. Now, when you go through the program, um, it's very simple to use. You do not need to be like a tech nerd to understand it. It's very user friendly um, and very clean, so it's not busy where there's too much going on, and that's something that's really really important. But yeah, number one advice really is just to practice as much as you can, especially in the areas that you know you're not good in. 
So like I mentioned earlier, my strong suit was not organic chemistry, and so I had to practice the heck out of that subject to make sure I could pass it on the PCAG. Um, and like I said, it's a standardized test. It's just like the SAT or the um, ACT or whatever else is out there nowadays. But you just have to practice as much as possible. And when you go in, be confident. Don't get nervous. Just be confident, be calm, collect it, and you're going to do just fine as long as you put in the work to do great. But yeah, that's enough of me rambling. If you have any other questions or anything else about the program, definitely leave them in the comments below. Or you can shoot me an email, DM, whatever else you can reach me. Um, I will answer them as quickly as possible. But yeah, before I go on, um, thank you guys so much for watching. And stay tuned for the next one. Bye!